Welcome! Today I'm going to be coloring some resins with some pigments made by Salesy. It's their 3D resin color pigment. I have some of their white UV resin for 3D printing. You can color UV resin or even epoxy resin, pretty much any kind of resin with, with pigments. So we'll play with that. And that way you can kind of see what the colors look like. And what I'm going to do, and what I would recommend you do if you're going to make your own colors of resins, that you keep a sheet of paper handy. And I keep track of how many drops of each pigment I use to create whatever colors I'm making. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do 100 milliliters at a time. I'll mix them into these clear containers just so that it's easy for me to see. Uh, I wouldn't recommend storing it in a clear container, as UV resin will, of course, cure. So here's the resin. They're fairly large containers. They even gave us some stirring sticks. C-M-Y-K. So let's get started with our base. You want to make sure you shake up your UV resin before you pour it. Also, make sure you shake your pigments up really well. And I don't have any measurements on the actual cup itself, so I'm just going to use this to get 100 milliliters. Then I can know what combinations to make my particular color, so I'll keep track of that. And then if I want to make more, then I'll just have to multiply that per how many hundred milliliters. I'm not going to print anything very big, but you'll you'll likely want more than 100 milliliters of whatever you're printing. Let's start with a green, shall we? I'm gonna do one drop at a time and keep track of the drops. Let's just see what one drop of blue will do. probably actually could add some black. It's a very dark green though. This is like a camo green. It's a nice darker colored green. So that color for 100 milliliters five drops cyan, three drops yellow, one drop black. And that gives me kind of a, I'm gonna call it camo green. That got pretty muddy pretty fast, but I do kind of like that deep purple. But that one is two cyan, ten magenta, one yellow, one black. It's actually a decent flesh tone. Two magenta, two yellow. It's kind of 
kind of a light orange. And for that, it was three magenta to eight yellow. So we'll print those and see what those look like. Now that I have all my prints done and I have only a little bit of resin and pretty much just covered the bottom which is why I printed such small things, I'm going to take the other colors and I'm just going to mix them all together and I'm going to put them in one side the other side so that it will slowly mix as it prints hopefully and then we'll see some of the colors blending together. This is our mixture. The purple got overpowered by the green. There were some in the supports that printed like this. wanted to make your own colors of resin for printing it's that easy again just as a recommendation keep track of how much resin you're mixing and how much pigment you're putting in in case you wanted to duplicate that color again like I like these colors I would do those again that's it for this video so until next time go and uh, print some cool colored prints.